Hi, this is Dr. C, and I want to read a little bit for you from uh, one of my recent narrations called Winter's Myths by the author Gage Greenwood. It's a post-apocalyptic story, um, and it's, it's just fascinating, and it, it is so much fun. So much fun. It blinded them. Brutal light. Winter dropped his bag and put one hand over his eyes. With his other hand, he slashed around behind himself, searching for his daughters. He gripped an arm. Candlesticks. He knew by the size. He rattled his fingertips against her skin, speaking in rapid taps. They called it the language of fear, when silence was necessary. Usually they communicated this way by tapping their fingers against their own hips, the receiver of the conversation reading those taps from a distance. But now, blinded, Winter tapped roughly against Candlestick's flesh, ensuring she knew what he was saying. Use both hands. One on sister, one on me. Do not let go. Do not let go. Do not let go. He tapped the last sentence repeatedly until she responded. Pinky, long tap. Pinky, long tap. Okay, okay. The rough, thunderous noise continued to roar in front of him, and without sight, he could only presume what caused it. All the horror stories he'd been told as a child came flooding back into his mind. At seven years old, Winter had snuck into the forbidden hall leading to the cement slab, and just as he reached it, his mother grabbed him, brought him into her arms, and squeezed him into her chest. Do not go near there. Everything outside of that door is pain or worse. The only thing the upper world does is kill. Winter separated his fingers, allowing the light to hit his eyes. He needed them to adjust quickly. Who knew what threats approached, masked by this fiery light and belching thunder? He stepped forward and back again, unwilling to exit without his senses. Slowly, the surroundings outside the slab took form, blurring into shapes and outlines, jutting stones. His feet left the safety of their home, the only place they'd ever known, and entered the world above, the place of demons, Earth. It's so cool, guys. You got you, you gotta go gotta go find that book. Um it's on audible.com now. Um Winter's Myths.